In this video, we present our video analysis tool called VideoTiger. While it's easy to record many hours of video, it can be surprisingly hard to extract relevant information from it. For example, in our own studies, we recorded whole lifespan videos of flies, which amount to three months of continuous video data for each individual. The situation is similar for ecological habitat studies, which use video and screening-like procedures, and end up with many video sequences containing little relevant content, while other sequences lead to important findings. If one wants to survey real experimental footage of events, there is currently no tool available that facilitates the task of exploration, annotation and visualisation. Exploration. Even though the video material is recorded with a clear purpose in mind, there needs to be a way to screen and understand the video as quickly as possible. Annotation. As scientists watch their recordings, they need the ability to immediately note the instance and location of any important event. This can be anything from just counting how many times something appears, to tracking its movements or characterising behaviours. Visualisation. To get a sense of the annotations and their relative context, it is useful to visualise and browse them at both a coarse and fine scales. To support these functions, VideoTiger comes with the following core features. Exploration. VideoTiger can handle any type of video clip recorded, for instance, by a webcam or a GoPro camera. It can also handle videos of virtually infinite length by seamlessly chaining shorter videos together. Video Tiger can navigate frame by frame or speed up the video to 60 times the original speed. Annotation. Video Tiger supports virtually infinite numbers of labels and users. We work together with other biologists to optimize the annotation workflow in many subtle but necessary ways. The most important usability improvements we built as a result of the feedback are thumbnails of adjacent frames that make it easy to see what happens in the previous and following frames, particularly when annotating behaviors. These help to decide in which frames the annotation should start and end. Any object can be manually tracked in the video with the mouse. If available, pre-computed trajectories can be imported to aid the annotation. We found it difficult to visualize the data we had collected. This becomes more and more challenging the longer the videos are, as one has to decide between detail or scope of the plotted graphs. As a solution to this problem, we developed a hierarchical visualization of the annotation data. In this visualization, we plot one stacked bar plot for days, hours, minutes and frames. The colors of the bars represent different classes. Each bar plot is a detailed view of the selected element in the bar plot above. The plot is interactive as the user can click on any bar to select it. For example, the user can click on the second day in the day plot. The bar plot underneath now shows the 24 hours of this day in detail. If the user clicks on the eighth hour, the plot will show the minutes in the minute plot below. Similarly, the user can click and select the 20th minute and see all annotations in this minute, with each bar representing and summarizing five frames. In this way, the user can quickly navigate between high-level representations down to fine details. Additionally, clicking on any frame in the visualization will load this frame in the video tagger. This is handy both for reviewing manual annotations or inspection of automatically produced results. Video tagger was made to appeal to biologists of different disciplines. We have made video tagger accessible to science who just want to download and use the software as is. To enable developers and data scientists to make the most of VideoTiger, we've included a plugin system and we will make the software open source. To prevent annotations from being locked into our software, we save all annotations in a simple CSV format which can be read by Excel, or or any other programming language of choice. VideoTiger can be installed on OS X Yosemite and Windows from our website using only a few clicks and with command line installation on Linux. One of the most exciting areas of progress in video analysis is computer-aided discovery through the use of machine learning tools. There is no one-size-fits-all solution that would work in all videos. We have therefore designed a plugin system similar to ImageJ. The flexibility of the plugin system encourages real collaborations between biologists and data scientists. As an example of the power of these plugins, we wrote a simple plugin that given a few annotations of an underwater video, classifies each frame in the video as containing fish or not. Using a two-hour video, we annotated frames every 10 minutes or so as either containing fish or not. We then ran the plugin, and after another 10 minutes of waiting for the automatic classifier to process the footage, we were presented with a new hierarchical visualization, showing that only a 10 minute long section of the video really contains fish. With this information, the researcher can focus on these interesting sections and can avoid the large parts of the video that contain nothing but empty sea. We adopt CSV as a format for all data import and export. This facilitates compatibility with other software. For example, it is possible to import pre-computed tracking data into VideoTiger, 
and video tiger annotations can directly be read by popular analysis tools such as Excel or, or MATLAB. In summary, video tiger is an end-to-end -end tool for video annotation of experiments. It helps us to explore, annotate and visualize long continuous videos. It is easy to use because it was built with non-computer scientists in mind. Despite the ease of use, VideoTagger drastically shortens the path from raw video to validated hypothesis.